Hi guys, this is Tanshree Chaudhary. For day five, we will be learning how to draw a bird and then color it in watercolor. Okay, so let's start. We will be taking our compass and scale, setting our compass to one point five centimeters, and then we will take four fingers space. Okay. or maybe three fingers it's up to you and your um, the page you are using i am using three fingers you can also use four fingers and then we will draw a circle right here okay now take your compass and your scale Set it to three centimeters. And we will draw it right here, but the compass point at the middle of the page and pencil point just touching to the first circle that we drew. Okay, and we will draw. Okay. Now when this is done, we will take our pencils and we will draw a triangle right here. You can do this with free hand or if you want a scale, you can draw it with a scale just by keeping this and scale like this you can draw a triangle okay then what we will do is draw a, another long line like this and attaching it to this one okay then drawing a small triangle right here again you can draw free hand okay And then you can also draw one more line right here. Okay. Then what we will do is we will draw eyes and beak of our bird. Okay. So this is the center of our circle. Drawing a straight line right here. You can draw this with scale also. And then we will draw our beak right here and our eyes right here. Okay. If now what we will do is make a bulge and join both the circles and here we will take the bulge inside and make the circle and join them. Then we will draw the feather for which we will do this. We are dividing the circle in two halves with a curved line like this. See the upper half and the lower half. Okay, and then what we will do is draw two lines to draw the branches. So first one we are drawing diagonally like this. In the same line we drew this one. This is our mid, and we draw a line right here to draw the eyes and beak. And we will take this line only parallelly. We will draw a line like this. And this we are not drawing here on the board, drawing above the board and below the board. Above the board you can take five centimeters, below the board you can take four centimeters. Okay, and then we will draw one more line which will be parallel to this line, this uh, tail of the board, or you can also call it a parallel to the whole board only. And we will draw a twelve centimeter line right here. Okay. After this, we will be drawing the legs of our bird. For this, we will join it here, and then we will give three paws of it. Okay, and we have our bird, and all the branches we can make leaves. Okay. 
and our drawing is complete okay now moving forward to coloring okay starting to color I am coloring my bird in yellow and blue color you can color in any color you want it is up to you before starting to color I would suggest take your water container and clean your brush this way just dip it in water and clean it okay now what you will do is take blue color in your brush and I would suggest more of water and less of color and let's start coloring Do not color the second half, we will just color the blue in the upper half. You can use any color instead of blue, but whichever color you are using, just color the upper half of the bird with it, not the lower half. Okay. Now taking a bit extra of blue, making it a bit darker, we will color the tail. And also we will give a darker tone right here. Drawing something like feathers. can just follow the way I am using my brush and you will not have any problem making the bird just like I did. Okay. Now I have cleaned my brush and I am taking brown color to paint the branches and we will paint the branches and birds so that we don't mix the color while painting it on the lower half of our bird okay so we will let this blue color dry and until then we will color the branches and the uh, leaves of the bird okay I am taking a dark brown color and coloring my branch. While coloring the branch you can take a thicker brush and color it so that you don't have to draw more with your pencil. After doing the branch I have moved towards doing the leaves. Painting the leaves with a green color
so now our blue color of our bird is dry so we will come back to our bird and color the lower half of our bird for which i am going to use yellow color and i'll be using orange to shade the part in darker color see slightly painted the part in yellow color and i have left this part a bit whitish and now i am taking up the color and taking orange color i am coloring this lower part and this and then spreading the color with my clean brush in the yellow part to mix it right orange color and just making a line here to mix the yellow with orange making the beak of the bird in red color of the board in black color and now since this part is already dried the blue part of our board I will be taking dark blue or a shade of blue and we already learned how to make a shade of blue by mixing blue and bit of black in it and then we will use it to make the feathers of our bird you could just follow my brush i'm just drawing strokes randomly shading the lower part of our bird
coloring the lower part of the eyes of the bird just giving a shade to it We're going on the feathers, giving a few strokes. The next part is to give a bit of detail to our leaves. So I'm taking dark green and strokes on the bird the leaves giving details to the plant just like we gave details to the board and we will give details to our branch and then make the paws of our bird with the same dark brown color now cleaning our brush I'm taking orange or reddish color in our brush to give a few details right here. Drawing random strokes. Then we clip to the back of the board and its eyes.
we are done with our little body here thank you everyone for watching the video and enjoying the session